right, y'all, back at you for episode number 24 of the Planting Pirates. Um, this is where we're gonna, we'll go around our yard and show you where we planted all the plants we got in our Plant Pirates episode number 24. You can check that out. The, we got all the plants we're about to show you. For how much, Teddy? What, how much should we pay? Zero. Zero dollars, that's right. All right, so let's start with, uh, you pointed over there, Teddy, what, what we got? Yeah, I got a list here so we don't forget anything, but. Yeah, over here we have, um, a ginger. What kind did you think it was? I think it's a shampoo ginger. Oh, you know what, bud? Before we go over there, or no, wait, right here, before we yeah. pass it, we did get this vine right here. This is a new one for us. It's a, um, it's a pothos vine, but it, it's a different one than what we have. This, I think this one's called the jade pothos. Mm -hmm. um, and we have the giant, uh, like, golden Hawaiian pothos already, yeah. but um, we don't have this one yet, so I'm stoked about that. So. All right, where's the where's the ginger that we planted? Well, there's also this. Oh yeah, so we got this. Here's one of the um, I don't know what this is a false agave or something. You guys can comment below. I'm not an expert on all these uh, cool. ornamentals, but yeah, we got. I think we got a couple of those, right, bud? Yeah, it, uh, we. Uh, this is what I was talking about. Yeah, so here's the ginger. I think it's a shampoo ginger. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Um, you know the what we're going for here guys is that we have real good luck with just putting cuttings right in the ground and it'll eventually shoot off new growth um and then we'll just cut that cut that down knock yeah. it off so um here's another little here like here's an example we did that right here there's just a, a just a cutting we just stuck right in the ground and um you can see the new growth finally so we'll cut that old uh that old shoot off we probably should have already done that just I just yeah, noticed it. So. All right, what else we got, kiddo? Um, we've got, um, we've got another false agave. Yeah, we here. did. Yeah, we do. Let's see, where's he taking us, guys? He's leading us on a wild goose chase. And over here, we don't we have, have any. We don't have any geese here, though. Hold on, let's show him this real quick. So here's this other uh, little false agave or whatever it is. These things get pretty big. They'll get to be like bigger than a basketball, way bigger than a basketball, and I guess. they're kind of ball shaped. Yeah, and they are kind of ball shaped, yeah. So where's the, what else do we do? The ginger right yeah. here? Yeah, all right. Did same, same more, kind. Sorry? Did you add more cordyline there? Not this, uh, this, that was from a different uh, find. So this is the same kind of ginger that we have over there that we just showed you guys. Um, and the, here's another ginger that we have that, again, we just got like a cutting, uh, no roots or anything, and stuck it in the ground. And look at all this new growth we got from it. So we have several different kinds of ginger yeah, now. Here's, that one is too. Yeah, mine. this is a variegated, what do we think this is? Variegated. A Hawaiian shampoo. Yeah. A variegated Hawaiian shampoo ginger. This one's really cool. Uh, and we've had real good luck with that one too, with uh, propagating it, so. Yeah. We like our gingers, we collect gingers, we collect, collect, collect. I collect tea plants, I collect surfboards, collect kids. All right, what else we got? I think we got some, well, I think we put some stuff in pots, right? Yeah. Yeah, that song I'm in here. Yeah. And a cactus. That little bromeliad? Oh yeah, the little bromeliad. It's right here. Yeah, actually, me and Teddy were just looking at this little bromeliad. Now, this is, um, we think it's that orange one that's going to get about as big as this right here. So, it, I might have planted it a little close to this. I might want to move it over. Because I think it'll look cool here, that color. Yeah. With the, um, yeah, because they're like, um, uh, with the heliconia cobbler. in the background. The lobster claw. Yeah. <laughs> heliconia. Uh, but anyways, uh, I think I need to move it over a little bit, um. I just noticed that, so I'll probably do that after we finish this video. What else we got? What else oh, we got? got? What we got? What we got? What we got? Oh, candelabra cactus. So what? Can candelabra. Careful, it's it's spiky. All right, let's show it to him. Let's see. Yeah, so this didn't have roots or anything, but I'll bet you that it will survive. Um, just sticking it in the pot. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. If anybody out there knows uh, more about this uh, than I do, which, I mean, if you know anything about this, you're going to know more than I do, but anybody out there that has any more information on this one, we'd appreciate it, because our youngest son, or our middle son, was super excited to find yes, this. So, that was his most yeah, so. Um, 
Oh, here, right behind it, here's some little tea plants that uh, that we have uh, that we got on this find. I just put them in groups of three in a couple pots because I uh, ran out of places this week for tea plants. I and gotta, we collect pots too. We collect so. tea plants, pots. <laughs> All right. What else we got? We got the Song of India. A nice specimen. Yeah, and the Song of India. So this one um, is another one you can just stick right in the ground from cuttings. Uh, where's that one that that, you, that we just had? The the not the variegated, the green one that we just pulled uh, out of the I ground. I just potted it. Yeah, we'll just rip it out of the yeah. pot and let's show them. So here's yeah. one that here's one that we got just a cutting of on the side of the road. Oh, sorry, you okay? Yeah. Um, maybe I don't know a month or maybe probably two months ago now. But I mean, all we did, all we have is just a cutting, just like, yes. just, a, just a cutting, nothing, just like someone cut it off their bush, top of their bush. We stuck it in the ground and in uh, maybe two, two and a half months, it grew all these roots. They're uh, pretty looking roots. Yeah, they are. They're like coral. Okay, they do look like coral. Yeah. So um, now, that being said, I haven't noticed that these are very fast growers. Uh, maybe it's because, you know, it's like a year two thing, you know, where they'll take off, but like, we 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 stuck several of these in the ground and they survived. Here's another one that we've had in a pot forever and ever, um, and it's still alive. In fact, I think it flowered for us, um, but it's not growing very fast. So I don't know. Okay. So I grouped some of these together in this pot, in a bigger pot. Uh, this is how I see it in people's landscapes yeah. or in pots. I see it in pots a lot. Gotcha. They're pretty in pots. I think I want some just in pots by the pool. Yeah. You see, guys, we got a problem here. <laughs> oh, look, we put, I have the flowers. I, put, I planted the flowers. I took that flower oh, off of Vermilion <laughs> today. I don't know what they're thinking, guys. They yeah. put it in my jackfruit pot, too. This is, we got a, we're real excited about this jackfruit. This was grown from seed. Seed, yeah. Uh, we so. got it, and then, like, it was just seed. Then a week later, it, we came out, and there's, like, a thing that Yeah, it's, it's, it's been it's growing like, fast. I, I might have put it in too big of a pot too soon, but it seems to be okay. It keeps shooting off new growth. Um, so these guys I definitely put in bigger pots too soon. I actually just put this in one in a smaller pot to see if that would help it because the soil just stays wet all the time. We need yeah. more uh, perlite in there. Yeah, I know. think it's a perlite thing. So yeah. There's not enough drainage for these plants. All right, guys, let me check my list here, but I think I think we got everything. I think that was what we got this week, eh? Yeah. Yeah. We, d we did a kind of, I'd say, a moderate amount oh, of searching. Oh, you added some tea plants up front. I did. That's right. Yep. One last thing we got here. Oh and, our, oh, and look at what our tea plants are doing. Some yeah, and they got flowers all over them. Oh, and the ones that... We have a nice big specimen in the backyard that has, like, open buds. Yes, we do. Yeah. Yeah, we do. Super cool. So, I like my tea plants. We got more tea plants. Here's some. Here's a, I show it to you guys on all of our videos, but I like my tea. Look how pretty they are. Oh, my gosh. Every leaf is different. I know. We got a different variety over here. We got several. We got, I don't know how many. I need to start counting how many yeah, varieties. Yeah, I'm going to count them after this. There's another one. This one's kind of blending in with the spider swart. And then we got this one right here. And I got a couple more varieties, but not in the front garden. So, oh, there's oh, this one's one. got a flower bud. Oh, and this, this one's the tiny oh, leaf. Oh, yeah. And we got that one, too. Good eye, buddy. Yeah. Oh, yeah, All that's right. a pretty flower. Yeah. All right, y'all. Well, uh, I think that's it. I'm going to wrap it up here. I think uh, Annalisa wants me to get back to work. Stop fiddling with the camera. So um, if you guys have any questions or comments about uh, anything uh, we showed you here, just post down below. Till next time, everybody out there, take care. Bye.